I'm Erica Soto. This is my baby. Her name is Lotus. She's a little lotus flower. <laughs> and today we're going to be doing a decorate with me. So if you're new, hi, welcome. Nice to see you. I hope you enjoy it and I hope you watch all the way through. And if you're returning, welcome back. I love you. Thank you. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. Okay, so here you just see me fluffing out the tree, um, trying to get it nice and as full looking as I possibly can. This is just my least favorite part about decorating or about putting up a tree. I'm sure it's everyone's least favorite part, but it's definitely my least favorite part. I don't know. It's just so boring and it always... It just never looks full to me. It just looks stupid. So I don't know. This is my least favorite part. But in the end, it comes together and it looks good. And for the top part of the tree, I just like to do that separate from the tree just so I'm not reaching over or having to stand on anything. Just so I'm just going to sit on the floor and fluff it out there. So here I'm super excited about this garland I found at the BX. It was on sale for $2, okay? And there were only two of them left. So I took them. I was so happy. I thought they were so cute. And as I'm putting it on the tree, I realize two of them aren't enough. So here's me just trying to work with it, thinking what I'm going to do. Um, I'm trying to space it out the most because sometimes when you don't have enough, you make it enough. Okay? There's no, there's no such thing as not having enough. You're going to make it enough. So that's what I'm doing here, just making it enough. another issue I was so happy to put up the tree topper Ugh, like the tree topper is my favorite part of putting up a tree because 
you get to see everything when it comes together and it's pretty much the final product but of course I bought the cheapest one I could find and there is no area for me to put it in so that's just me confused and kind of annoyed the last issue I run into is that my tree mat is not big enough at all like look at that that is so small it looks so stupid I'm so annoyed with it but it is what it is whatever this is the tree the issues I was having was one this skirt was far too small which is what I knew well I didn't think it would be this small but the other skirts I were looking at was $30 and that one was $10. So you get what you pay for. And another issue I was having is my tree topper. It doesn't have a place to like stick in to the tree. So I don't really know how to put it on. So I had this ingenious idea of either just sticking it in, like just sticking the tree topper just into the pines to see if it will work, or to try to stick the pines into the back of the tree, the tree topper. And I really thought that was going to work. And I was so excited. I'm like, okay, maybe I'll get to have a tree topper. But no, it just fell right over and it looked so stupid. And I'm just so upset with it. So finally, I just decide to give up and we aren't going to have a tree topper. And that's it. Okay, well, that's unfortunate. I don't have anywhere, like any way to put up the tree topper. There's also no plug because we bought the tree pre-lit. So there's no plug to plug in the the tree topper even if we were to be able to put it up all right so this is the fin finished product this is our tree it's actually a lot taller than we thought it was gonna be we have nine and a half foot ceilings and with the topper I was like very close so that is unfortunate but yeah this is my Christmas on the budget these are all we're going to do we also bought some lights to go outside and that's all, you know. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope this inspired you if you don't already have your trees up. I know a lot of people did. I'm very late. I don't want my tree. I don't even want to look or think about Christmas until December. So <laughs> I know you guys already probably have your trees up. But if you don't, this was your motivation to put it up. I hope I see you guys later in more vlogs. Tell me what you liked about it. Tell me what you didn't. You know, as always, comment things I could do better or things you would like to see. But I'm going to go. I appreciate everybody. Thank you so much. And I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful Christmas and a really, really good New Year. So I love you guys. Bye.